Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are going to be taking a look around the Harrogate at Lucas Gardens in Shefford. We have a beautiful green, I don't know, sage green, olive green door and a beautiful canopy as well. By the way, this property is actually rendered and with a brick face and some tiling. Let's go in. Oh! Did you hear that? I did. I love a doorbell. Oh, we love a doorbell. Ah, and here we are. <laughs> Ooh. So, we have actually toured Harrogate before, but this one is at Lucas Gardens here in Shefford. Um, and there might be some differences. There might also be, well, there is obviously some decor differences as well. So, let's take a look. We are in the hallway. We are. It's a lovely hallway. It's a beautiful hallway. You can see um, upstairs. Red Row always has tall ceilings and really high skirting boards. They do. Um, so you really do get a sense of space. Everything feels really spacious. It just feels grand. Yeah, there's definitely room, coats and shoes. Um, you can configure this exactly how you want. If we take a look at the doorway, again, it's a tall doorway. I mean, I'm five foot eight with hair <laughs> and, uh, and I can barely touch the top of the of the door without tiptoeing. You've got the glazed panels either side. They are frosted for privacy. You've got the security letterbox, which means that no one can put any hooks under to try and hook your keys. Um, you've also got the security peephole, uh, although you can kind of see who's who's outside anyway yeah. from the glass. Um, but it is lovely. And there is also some light switches over here. Um, and I think the doorbell is here as well. There we go. I think, no, is that the thermostat? That's that might the be the thermostat. Yeah, because it's got a little switch. Um, oh, the doorbell's here. There you go. There the it doorbell's is. over here. And there's also a security latch as well. Um, the flooring, I do believe, is it's hard flooring in here, and it is Antico, and it carries on into the kitchen, which we'll show you in a little while. Shall we go to the living room? We shall. Let's go. Okay. Ooh. 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 Yeah, this is very different to the one that we viewed previously. Yes. Um... But I like it. I do. I like it's the lovely. light. Yeah, it's a, the lighting is really cool. Um, again, it's a low light, but because it's in the centre of the room, you're not going to bang your head on it, basically. No. So it's like a feature. It's a feature light, um, but it doesn't kind of obstruct anything. In fact, even when you sat down, you can still see the TV. Which Perfectly is fine. mounted on the wall. Um, there's no fireplace in this property. You might be able to add one as an optional extra. There is always a big optional extras list with Red Row Homes. So do check out, at whichever development you're looking at, do check which ones are available for you to purchase. But this one is shown with just the TV on the wall. This is what you can do yourselves. There isn't a bay window, but there is a very big window. Oh, it's a huge window. It's a big window with lots of opening vents. We haven't actually spoken about the vents, I don't think. No. And so you've got like a left and a right opening vent, and top and bottom. So you can get a lot of ventilation. The high ceilings mean you can get a lot of curtain. Yes. <laughs> There's a big drop of curtain, which again, kind of gives that really hotel vibe because um, the track is actually hung suspended from the ceiling, so you get very high, dramatic drop with the curtains. Um, they've gone for a neutral carpet in here, but if you just pan through, it matches the floor oh, it quite does. well. Oh, wow. So you do get the illusion of con continuity with the flooring, but obviously you get the warmth of the carpet in the living room. The doors. Now, I think these are the optional upgrades. Possibly. Because they are the wood effect. Um, and they've got the nice kind of chrome silver handles. And of course, they are kind of wooden panels. They feel quite solid. Oh, yeah. I yeah, love this wallpaper. Yeah. I think it's stunning. Does it remind you of the ocean? It does a little bit. I, I thought it was fish when we first came in. I thought it was fish, but it's... Is it? Is it? No. No, I just think it's like just a blue pattern. Yeah. Um, but it is really, really lovely. Again, they've gone for the trend of a kind of like a gallery wall. I know gallery photograph paintings in a cluster is quite Trendy. on trend at the moment. So they've gone for that over the sofa. Of course, you could have whatever you wanted. They've gone for a mirror over here, which is another good, uh, good idea because it does bounce back and reflect all of the light. Again, big statement lamps, which I like. I don't like a small lamp. If you've watched our house tours, you will know 
I don't like little tiny weeny lights. I like big statement lights. And these are very, very big statement lights. Um, it's a lovely living room. And I think, I think I could relax in here. Oh yeah, it, it's I'm very... Take a seat. Oh, right. So relax. Tell me what you think. I think that that light does not get in the way of the telly at all. It doesn't, because you have a slight issue with low-hanging lights, I don't do. you? I do. If there wasn't a table underneath that light, I would just walk into it all the time. Yeah, whereas it's it's nice. I like it. Mm, it's lovely. I, I, I'm still not over the wallpaper. I love it. It is really lovely wallpaper. It's and see, but I love a feature wall. You do. You could also have, like, a window seat there. Yeah. Uh, you could have, like, a low bonquette. I a think bonquette. a bonquette. A bonquette. A bonquette. Thank you very much. Don't bonquette. you don't you bonk on my bonquette. Thank you very much. No, you could have you could have a window seat. You could have a love seat. Yeah. Whatever you wanted over there. They've got a single chair, but you could have what you wanted. You could have a poof, a poofet, a poofette. Poof. Poof. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah. In, instead of coffee tables if you wanted. Um but yeah, there is lots of I'm going to come and sit with you. There is lots of space here. So I think we should move on. Yeah. Oh, well, there's also a nice um, kind of space-saving radiator as well there under is. the window, which I've just noticed. And we've got the bunny chopped cushions. We have the bunny bunny chopped cushion, which we like. There's also uh, plugs over here. And I imagine there is a media point somewhere I behind here. Behind the telly. Yes, there, there are some switches down there. So shall we move on? Yeah. Carry on. I'm going to hand back to you. <laughs> right. Follow through. Now, the last time, the last time we were in Harrogate, we were astounded. By we the were kitchen. We were like, wow, 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 wow. Because this kitchen is amazing, and I'm really looking forward to see what they've done with it in on this development. But it reminds us of the kitchen that we're actually going to get for our new home. It does. Ourselves. Uh, wow, it's oh, it is oh, gorgeous. I'm not disappointed a second time, are you? No. Ah, oh, this is lovely. Now, of course, this is the other way around from the other show home yeah. that we saw. It is, isn't it? Um, I think the other one was a. This is either a, a left or a right, and I can't, I, I can't remember what the other one was. Just look back at the videos, you'll yeah, find out. Yeah, but it's the other way. It's the opposite way around. Um, I don't know which way I like better, but it's just still it's, lovely. It's the same, but it's just lovely. It's so sociable. You can literally entertain here. You can have family, kids, guests, whatever you want going on over there. You can have people eating in the space just behind where you are. Um, and you can all be controlling the operation. You can be the momager. You can be the <laughs> momager of the home right from the heart of this kitchen. It's gorgeous. Really, really good. Now this is, uh, I think, an optional upgrade worktop. The quartz, you can um, see the ribboning in there. It, see, I'm not, I get confused whether it's quartz, uh, silstone, or granite. And I think this might be. This might be the granite? Might be, might be granite. Um, but like I say, everything varies from development to development, so do check. But this island is just gorgeous. It's lovely. It's, the, it's the mothership. It's the control <laughs> centre of the home. It is. You can see the pattern as well they've gone for. Yes. Like okay. a marble effect. River marble? Yeah. River and there is something I've noticed in this island as well, I which notice. we love, which is a... Oh, that's bugs. gorgeous. Oh. It's so handy. That is the greatest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. And when we saw this, we were like, we need to get this. We do. When we have our new kitchen in our, in our new home, we need one of these in here. And of course, if you're buying red room, you don't need to because it's... If you it's have, already there. If you have the island as an upgrade, it's there. And then you can just, once you're done with it... Yeah, it's just Pick so it handy around. because if you are baking, if you have any extra appliances that you want plugging in to use this worktop, this island as an actual working space, it's so much easier having the plugs. It is. It's right. So gorgeous. Shall we have a rummage? Um, yeah. Ooh, I don't know where to start. Should we do the cupboards? Yeah, cupboards oh, first. Okay. Let's have a rummage. Um, so the cupboards, I, they have a slight wood grain effect. I'm not, the camera might not pick it up, but they have a slight uh, kind wood of wood grain effect. Um, kind of shaker style, but with a wood grain. Um, nice handles. And we have the fridge freezer. Uh, this is a four drawer freezer. Ooh, normally when you get a three drawer. Yeah, so you, like I said, it, they take full advantage of the height of the space. They do. This is the Lucy. There's even a space at the top. There is, so you could put bottles. Yeah, possibly bottles. 
um, things that you might want to refrigerate later. Um, that's the new thing. Uh, we have a cupboard above the cooker. Handy. Above the oven. Maybe baking trays. We have a, a double, I think it's a grill. Yeah, you've got a, a grill, grill and an oven. oven. Which is again, what you need. Places for pots and pans yep. underneath. Um, an upper cupboard. Brilliant for Ooh. making tea, coffees. Cups, glasses. Oh, no. Let us know in the comment section, what would you put in these cupboards? <laughs> So now everyone has different things, everyone um, has different... Ooh, no, big drawers. Big cutlery drawer. Big and cutlery an induction drawers. hob. Yeah, which is Siemens. Um, again, more, more pan drawers. Pan drawers are really useful. If you've not had them. My mother has them and they are amazing. But you've got the same backsplash as the worktop, which is good. And the cooker hood is Siemens as well. Got a corner cupboard. Ooh, how far does it go back? Does it go back all the way? I think it's quite deep. Ooh. Oh, it does, yeah. That's yeah, good. You, know, you can you can hide your things away that you don't use very often. Yeah. In the, the back. Things that you don't want to throw away, but you, you might need. Got all the plugs all the way. Very handy. Um, ooh. Under the cupboard. Yeah, there we go. Uh, the sink is obviously inbuilt into the worktop and it is stainless steel. Siemens dishwasher. dishwasher. So when you are washing your dishes, it's very easy actually to put them onto the island ready before putting yeah. them away. So we like that one. Nice window to look onto your garden while you're doing Ooh, the washing up. If, you are nice. doing, if you're not using the dishwasher and you want to wash up, you can look at your garden. View. It's lovely actually. Yeah. Uh, we'll take a look at the gardens later, I think. Oh, and now, let me oh, go around the other way. Yeah. Uh, let me do that again. Ta -da! <gasps> Look at that, the gorgeous. The cupboard, isn't that lovely? You can have all your beautiful organisation on display because I know you're all organised. You've all got your containers all labelled up. I know, <laughs> I know, don't need to tell me twice. Right, you've got your beautiful drawers as well. So tea towels in this drawer? Yeah, to be honest, uh, there is a lot of drawer space in this oh, yeah. kitchen which we were very impressed by, because you don't normally get a lot of drawer space no. in places. So, amazing. Again, you've got the Antico flooring. Um, should we see the, oh, no, we have to look under here. Under oh, the is arm. there cupboards? Oh, yes, it's cupboards. Come and look. Oh, look cupboard. cupboard. Look at all this Cupboard. Space. Cupboard. Yes. And I imagine you, one of the upgrades you could yeah, have is change I, one of these to a wine cooler. I think in the last case, was there one? I think there was. Um, so again, check all the upgrades because there might, there might be things you could add. You've got the bar stools because you can just purge. Oh, I feel like I'm on blind dates. Ah! Remember the old blind dates with Simmer? I'm on, I'm on stool number two. I'm number two. <laughs> What's your name and where did you come from? <laughs> no, it's lovely. Again, you can just, you can have a conversation if you've got friends around and you're cooking, you can have your glass of vino, you can be chilling. It's lovely. Yeah. Lighting. Um, lovely. Yeah. I actually quite like this. Not too low. No, they're, they're, nice. they're quite nice and simple. They do the job and yeah. they're quite nice to look at, actually. And actually, there's a lot of spotlights in this kitchen. Oh, yes. So it's a very light and bright kitchen. Because actually, you've got the light from all, all walls. Yeah, you've actually. got windows there, double doors, mm. windows. It's plenty of light. The sofa area. Now, this area I like. It's oh, lovely. yeah. It really is lovely. You can sit, relax, watch TV. Again, you could have another little window kind of CT area here. I know you've got the radiator, but you could put something there. Maybe a, oh, a floor cushion. Yeah. You could put a big kind of bean baggy floor cushion. If you've got pets as well, it's a really good room for, for having pets because they can sit wherever they want. And it's a good room to be able to have a look at what your neighbours are up to. What's Doreen up to next door? What, what is Doreen up to? Oh, she's got a new car. <gasps> Dory. Dory. How can she afford that? <laughs> I don't know. She has a pay run. Right. We have a cupboard. Ooh. Uh, again, actually very useful. Mop, bucket, yeah. hoover, vacuum, whatever. If you've it's got any deep. additional appliance. Yeah. Oh, it's quite deep that. Quite, I mean, it? it goes more shallow because obviously the stairs yeah. are above. But it's nice. It's gorgeous. Um, handy storage space, which we, which we like. Dining area. 
A lovely dining yeah, table. Yeah, in fact, we've got a table very similar, haven't we? We have. Um, and it is very practical and very functional. Um, yeah, it's lovely. And again, you've got the track curtains, which gives the dramatic um, height and drop. The gardens, now, of course, there are several houses, so you, you aren't going to get this width. No. Uh, there will be fences coming down, but it, it is still quite a deep garden. Yeah, it's not bad. So basically, it, you'll, you'll get the width of, of the house and two fences going down. Um, but you're not... It, it's, it's lovely, and they, they landscape the gardens really mm. well. One thing you might notice over there is a little digger. Oh, yeah. So when we were speaking to the sales centre, apparently one of the optional extras you can now get on this site, and I imagine from future sites as well, is that you can have a home office built in the garden. That's really handy. Yes, so if you're still working from home, or if you find out you're permanently working from home, you can have your own office yeah. built as it's well. It's a shame we, we can't show that fully built, yeah. but they are literally just putting it in. Um, so again, check out what's available on your development, uh, but, but they are available on this development at Lucas Gardens. Let's go about the, the doors as well. So a French patio door with two single glazed panels either side. Again, very handy, very functional. And yeah. you've got the utility room. Oh, we love a utility. We do love the utility room. You, it's, it's actually in the layout that I like, with a centre cupboard to put all your cleaning things in, uh, your cleaning apparel. Um, and you've got space for washing machine, tumble dryer. And I imagine this is the boiler. Yep. Uh, it's a Worcester Bosch boiler. Again, very good for the house. You've got some more control panels over here. Radiator, space for pet food. Oh yeah, definitely. Pets, cats, dogs, whatever. Oh, downstairs Ooh. loo. Giant turtles. <laughs> Go and have a look at that loo. Okay, so we have a lovely toilet, push button flush. Yeah. Oh, we've got your um, fuse box. Yeah, so there's a little key for that one. Um, okay, and then... Window. Yeah, we've got a nice little window. It's a cloak room. And behind me, we have a very nice sink unit, actually. Yes, it is sutini, and you have a cloak storage Ooh. cupboard. I like these spots. Yeah, they move. They do. It's like Jenga. <laughs> Ooh, look, isn't that lovely? And the, the tiles are nice as well. Yes. They feel really nice. They, they're kind of a matte finish. Um, I think they will clean really well, and I think they'll stay really, really nice. Um, the colours on the walls are kind of like pastel. They're yeah, kind of it's pastel-y pastel colours. It's a very... Which I actually really like. Yeah, it's a blue theme throughout the house, or downstairs yeah. anyway. It's really quite nice. And you've got the glazed door, so that if you, I mean, if you were happen to be in a state of undress on the toilet, <laughs> people aren't going to see you. No. Um, but no, it's lovely. I'm, again, I'm, I'm in awe of the kitchen. <laughs> it's gorgeous. It is gorgeous. I just love this layout. It's so good. Shall we go up? Yes, let's have a look upstairs. Uh, oh, the banister. Oh, this is a thick banister. It is. Oh, it's like any other one. That's very girthy. I just want to like clutch it and <laughs> I want to go backwards. I want to go backwards up the stairs. <laughs> I feel like it's a sort of It's a ballet bar. It's a ballet bar. It's gorgeous. Right. <laughs> Ooh, but it's very nice carpet actually as well. Yeah, no, you can feel the pile. You can you can feel the pile, it's gorgeous. Now, where should we go? Left, right? Uh, left. For some reason, go... This landing looks more spacious than I remember. It does. Maybe it's Ooh. the orientation of the house. So who do we have? A bedroom. Ooh, okay. Okay, it's a nice size bedroom. Yeah. Um, so, it's, it's, a, it's a perfect size bedroom. Yeah. Um, if you look behind where you are, there is space for fitted wardrobes. There are. You, you can see like own. an alcove. Yeah, and I actually, I quite, quite like it when they actually show that you can put your own wardrobes in. Yeah. Because if you do have furniture, you don't have to have the optional extras of the fitted wardrobes, you can just put your own furniture in and it works. So there's obviously working from home, study space in the room. Actually, it shows that you've actually got quite a lot of depth in this room. Yeah, because you've got a desk and yeah. a double bed. And for those of you who want to know the room dimensions, we will put the dimensions at the very end of the video, so do stay watching. And the bed, again, you could have a wide bed, to be honest. Oh, could easily, because there's so much space. Yeah, I think this is a regular double, but you could go bigger, to yeah. be honest. Um, decor, I think it's done out for someone who's in sports. Oh, definitely. Maybe, cricket. Maybe a teen. Lots of cricket posters. Yeah, I think maybe a teenager. Uh, but again, beautiful windows. And if you want to know how they open, 
I've managed to open one there. Um, you can see yeah. a lovely view onto the drainage pool. Yeah, that's um, obviously in an overspill drainage pool, yeah. which is lovely. Windows actually feel like they've got quite a nice mechanism. They are really they, good windows. They are. Yeah, but there's our wardrobe again with the alcove, ready for an inbuilt one if you wanted it. Yeah. Oh, right. Per perfect guest bedroom, child's bedroom. Whatever you want. Okay, perfect. mystery door. I reckon it's a cupboard, if I remember. Yeah, cupboard with yeah. your water pressure thing. So you can't really get much more in there, but in a house this size, you do need the um, added pressure yeah. rather than just having a combi boiler. So it's got to go somewhere, and that is as good a space as any. Right. Ooh. Bedroom number two. Oh, I like this one. Ooh, it's nice. Yeah. I think it's a similar size to the last one. It's just in this yeah, one they I have... Yeah, I think they're quite similar, so... You know, if you've got two children who want very similar sized bedrooms and you don't want any arguments... Done. This is good. What is this? <laughs> is it a book? It's a book, but I've never seen one hung on no. the wall. No! I, I quite like it though. You could have your, your, your dreams. You could keep your dreams and aspirations. <gasps> Dream journal. You could. Uh, now, these are examples of the fitted wardrobes, which are the optional extras. Go and have a look, they're very yeah. deep. If you notice, not only are they deep, but they're also built into the actual space that's yeah. the wall cavity as well, so it goes quite far it, in. It does. As well, on both the top and the bottom. Yeah, so, so I mean, I can stand up in here. <laughs> oh, easily. I can stand up and, you know, there's, easily. there's so much space. Yeah, and there is a closed rail. Yeah. Single, Just, single height rail. See, from my height at this distance, if I told you up to my height, you can't actually see the closed rail. <laughs> so I always get confused, like, is there a closed rail? And of course there's storage on the top On the well. top. And right the way down. Yeah. Isn't now there good? is also a choice, a different choice, I think, of the mirrored doors and yes. different styles of wardrobe. So you would have to visit the customer experience suite or the sales center, and you can customize the home how you want basically. Yeah. Let's move on. Uh, again, overlooking the garden. It's a nice view of the room. garden. Oh, I, I like the cushions. I, I can't leave for commenting on these cushions. I love them. You love a tassel. I do love a tassel. These ones you can't actually bunny chop. They're, they're non-bunny choppable. Non-karate chop. Scandal. Oh, Scandal. Ooh, okay. bathroom. Ooh, family bathroom. Mm -hmm. So yes, lovely. Mm. Uh, mirrored cabinet, which opens. Ooh, and it's got and it's lit up around the edge as yeah, well. Yeah, so there is obviously shelves that go there. Yeah. So again, this will be an optional extra. We have a towel rail on the side. It's a good handy um, yeah. use of space to put that in. Shave the socket. Um, same satini sink as downstairs. There we go. Same gender drawers inside. Yeah, lovely um, loo. Toilet, yeah. And it comes with a loo roll holder. Well, I think it does. <laughs> <laughs> Not entirely. You'd have to check, but yeah. Um, does it? Yeah, toilet roll holder. Or No, these are upgrades. Oh, uh, they're upgrades. So the upgrades in here are the half-height wall tiles, the basin cabinet, the mirrored cabinet, down lights, toilet roll holder, and the flooring. Hmm. Um, but obviously talk to your sales rep about what's included, because it could differ yeah. from development to development. Nice shower screen, shower over the bath, useful ledge, again, nice use of tiling. You've got the vent above on the ceiling as well. Yeah, lovely. Beautiful. I could imagine myself having a soak in that one. Very easily. Um, let's go through to this one. Okay, so this I think is the smallest bedroom. Yes, they, um, they put this out as like a study office. Yeah, which is very handy because so many people, I mean, don't actually use all of their bedrooms as no. bedrooms. So it's a lot of people are turning their smallest bedroom into an office because they're working they from are. home. Or they've got kids who want a separate office space for their schoolwork. This is perfect. I love this sofa. Oh yeah, and to be fair, with the size of the room, there's, there's room enough to get a bed across that wall. Yes. Oh yeah, yeah, this room can, can take a bed. Absolutely. Definitely a single. You probably could get a double in as well. Yeah. You've got the, got the room. In fact, you could probably get a double bed there, and then in this alcove, you could have a wardrobe. And yeah. What else if, do you need in a bedroom? If you needed to. Um, I quite like the way they've got it set up. Yeah. Um, like I say, lots of people don't actually use all of their bedrooms as bedrooms. So, I mean, you could even have this as a wardrobe room. It's very fashionable now for people to turn an entire room into a walk-in wardrobe. Yeah. This would be ideal, especially as it's next to the master bedroom. Yeah. Should we go have a look at the master? Yes. I love this couch. It is, it is gorgeous. <laughs> no, it's lovely. Mm. Right. Very, very, very nice. 
On to the master. Yes. Are we ready? Are we ready? Ooh, it's big. Ooh, it is She big. is big. So. Yeah. I like how they've done the headboard. It's a big white headboard, so it's wider than the bed. Uh, but they've also had the feet to wallpaper wider as well. Yeah. Uh, but not all the way up. So it, it is really, really nice. looks big and grand. It is. And, and you think this room is big. You wait. I turn around. Oh, look, you have a whole dressing area Ooh. with wow. four built-in wardrobes. Yeah. Again, you've probably got a choice of, of doors. <laughs> yeah, does it go all the way around the corner? I think so. Can you get round? I think so, yeah. Can you shut me in? Oh, I'm coming. Hello. Hello. Yeah, you can get all the way around. <laughs> you can. No, it's lovely. Oh, the lights are on sensor as well, I think. Oh, that's good. Yeah, so it's a big wardrobe. Oh yeah, definitely. Big, 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 big. And I like as well how the actual clothes rails, they go all the way to the wall yeah. on both sides, essentially. Yeah. So you can, however you want to fill them. You can, you with can ease. Them. You can have a his and hers. Yeah. You've got storage all the way across. It's beautiful. Brilliant. Um, and the ensuite is slightly on the angle Ooh. in this room. Which again, I think gives an... Ooh, rainfall. <gasps> Ooh, the, rainfall? the family that. bathroom didn't. Um, no, but... Ooh, ooh look, look at that. that. I think this bathroom might be different to the other yeah. that we saw. So it just goes to show how you can have them differently. I can't remember a rainfall in the, in the other one. Uh, but it's lovely. Mounted from the ceiling. Oh, you can have a good time in here. Oh, you could. You can have a good time. You can sit, you can scrub, you can do whatever you want. I actually quite like sometimes just to sit. I really do. I like to just sit with the rainfall on. Because we've got a rainfall shower and it's gorgeous. I like to just sit and meditate, and it's lovely. Uh, you've got the controls for the shower over here. It's an Aqualisa, and you've got the, um, the handheld one as well. Towel rail, tiles. Again, you've got the same satini sink with the pull-out drawers for storage. And a mirrored cabinet, lovely. Um, perfect, it's almost like one holiday. It is. It's like a holiday, it's like a holiday. It's like a hotel room's bathroom. Yeah. It's like you're in some kind of luxurious uh, spa. And after the few years we've had, we all need to go on holiday. We do. So you why can feel not it go, every so, day. So why not, yeah, why not feel it every day? Exactly. It's gorgeous. And of course there's space for TV, if you want to watch TV in the bedroom. Right here. Or of course a glam station. Yeah, ooh, or glam station. Whatever you want. <laughs> glam station with a telly and you can watch us from your bed. You can, <laughs> absolutely. It's nice to smell this. Mm. Ooh, loft patch. Oh, oh, and there's, there is a loft also, hatch. Yeah, loft hatch. Just above the landing, so nice and easy to get to as well. Okay, so we're going to end this vlog in our favourite room, which of course is the kitchen. Oh, definitely. Good. We love this house. Oh, we do. It's, it's just gorgeous. Yeah, I think it would suit a complete variety of different yeah. families. If you're looking at this development, contact the sales centre. All the details, all the contact details will be in the description box below. Dimen room dimensions will be at the end of the video and the floor plans. Also, if you're looking for this house type somewhere else, check the Red Row website. The link will be in the description box below as well. If you have a property that you would like us to highlight and showcase in one of our house tours, do contact us from the business email in the description box below. Thank you for watching this video. If you have enjoyed it, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to share on social media and also do hit the bell so that you know whenever we upload a new video. So from us, to you all and goodbye.